Satchitananda. So now you can see your eternal destiny to free human souls from the misery of the evil forces that separate thee, that separate your individual unique self from the all self. What more sublime gift can your human life be than to keep flowing the evolutionary tears of humanity into humanity's sacred ocean of tears, these tears, holy beads of joy and pain, birth and death, um, are the organic life juices of our earth kind's evolution. Whence realized, naturally dry up and evaporate from the lower dimensions. Like true lovers splitting up for a while into individualistic self-searches so that they can come back together again in a finer diviner synthesis of their love soul becoming one. Until the whole spirit of our species is enlightened enough to realize its true essential oneness. And once realized that oneness, our race shall be reborn into a higher dimension within its own natural nature mm -hmm. and proper to the populace of our light density planet as you now know being me on the essential shore of the universal vibration so suddenly startling the stillness of infinitely integrated light. I am you. You are me. You see yourself in me as we are wed in one world's revision bed. Yet, <laughs> even such reasonable rhythm, such plausible processes be, but a spiritual mental species seeking to see itself in all the rhythmic forms of its evolving light until divine poetry erupts love from your long damned heart <laughs> releasing its molten tension releasing lyrical lava into the awesome cosmic atmosphere such a tenanda. Hmm. Hmm. What's that, Goddess Sarah? It, go into, go down by the river. Take your uh, your viewers down by the river. Put on a fancy performance art costume and like uh, just improv this thing. <laughs> Okay, let's go down by the creek and I'll tell you all about it. Om Namah Shivaya.